What's up, everybody, and welcome. This is that Haze Demon stream for that South Park Phone Destroyer. You know what I'm saying. And check it out. It's a scary clown. Oh, my God. Because it's getting to be that Halloween time, and you know it. But what's up, everybody? Already hanging out in the chat. It's going to be Nasty Chicken Foot, Professor Chaos. Emily Wooten, whoop, whoop. Fernando Reyes, Dimunko LP, Gui Carreria, and Alien Freitas. Welcome, guys. We are ready to get the stream popping. You know what I'm saying? We are ready to do that challenge. I watched a few of Pharaoh's streams yesterday. He actually played two streams. Let me hold on. Let me twist this up just a little bit there. Oh, right. He played two streams. I was watching them. It seemed like it was a pretty interesting challenge, I dare say. There we go. Now I figured out where the music seemed like it was a little bit lower. Now we good to go. We good to go. Finally figured out there at the last moment. Let's go ahead and check out what we've got in those free packs today. What's up, FL Far says hallelujah. Looks like it's gonna be that Inuit Kenny in the daily shop, but I will be unable to get him right now. So let's go ahead and open up this free pack. Looks like we have one hour and six minutes until the second one. So we only have one for right now. Demaka says, hope you are going for the third place, LMAO. Oh, uh, I never really try too hard for ranking leaderboard. You have to play it a lot, and honestly, I just play it a little bit. Just uh, just for you guys, you know what I'm saying? I'm not sure we really need Ancient Keys at this point now that we have 900 of them. Top, top Secret Chips, 500? I dare say we probably need more, but we don't need as many as I normally would get, so we'll get 10 of them. It sounds like there is no game audio, so I'm going to have to refresh the game before we continue onward but let's go ahead and finish up these roundabout through the shops you know what i'm saying Demaka said i play just two runs see that's basically what we're looking at here we're probably gonna do two runs today and that'll be all oh, you know what i'm saying let's check out the shop here it's gonna be that bounty hunter kyle we've got zero out of 100 but i'm looking to upgrade him Oh, yes. And it's going to be that three copies. Can you dig it? Transmorgify, not very important to get to level four. So we're just going to leave it at still getting it very randomly. Don't think we really need those. And I think we're looking pretty good on those now. So. Donations and request. Professor says, I'm waiting for dog poo, not level to up. Bees. Don't forget to subscribe, baby. So we got that Memzy here. 2963 out of 3,000. Added in there, that'd be 60, 75. That means that after we get our request filled, we will be 25 copies away from them. It's like the dragon's... In Game of Thrones, I hear the dragons are coming. The dragons are coming. Yes, that level seven, he is coming sooner or later, right? You know, we pretend like it's so close and yet it's so far away. Really, it's only tomorrow though, but I could pretend like it's even longer and be like Sunday. No, I'm just kidding, I wouldn't do that. We're gonna definitely be getting that level seven Mimsy tomorrow. So you guys better be there or be square. Looks like Slavia says, welcome back. What do you know with a smiley face? Alright, so. Go ahead and show you guys the deck real quick. Roger Jacob says, buy Inuit Kenny. I do not have the money for Inuit Kenny right now. As I had actually bought some packs yesterday. For this program stan. We are currently 99 out of 100 copies of program stan. So very close. So very beautiful. Professor K said Transmogrify should be rare and UC epic. I agree with you. That makes a lot of sense, actually. But that's going to be beautiful. 
beautiful indeed. So the deck we will be using today is going to be this fantasy adventure deck with a hint of Sheriff Cartman. As I don't think we always run Cartman during this during these modes, but I feel like during this double damage, Sheriff Cartman's going to put that extra ump in the the junk in the trunk. You know what I'm saying? He's going to be bouncing around and bouncing him out of the ring. So. Grease Chris is almost on the 100 cards. There you go. You know what I'm saying. It's going to be a stream shortly coming. If not in the middle of a stream, we will get him to level 5. So if you guys want to see that, you got to stay tuned. You know what I'm saying? That that level 5 is coming in hot, please. Even though he's going to be freezing everything like Mr. Freeze. So this is going to be our free challenge run. Can we handle the competition that's going to be coming at us i don't even know but let's hit that join button processing and play let's go nasty chicken foot says how far is mimsy we at the end of our request that we currently just took we are 25 copies away from getting that mimsy up to level seven the max level of cards you can get a card you can get too Darkness Alex says, hey, you have a cool shirt. Thank you. It's a little scary, don't you think? Rescue Ranger. And we've got that Sativa from Tesseract 420. But yeah, I forgot to reset the game. So we're going to have to do that after this match, if I can remember. Let's start out with the PC principal. Ill the Wii in the back. No sound cues. We can just hook in Clyde for the lulls as we just want to put out some damage and it's a miss. A hook Clyde and Messer. And he hits our hook hand Clyde gloriously. That extra damage looking pretty good, although it wasn't anything to do with that there. He puts in the shield onto. Wait! Our Paladin Butters doesn't even die from the rogue token there. Putting in one hit on the NK. We could get up this here. We'll leave the end of mini moons i think he can handle that situation there pc principal taking the candy bar let's go ahead and drop that fireball across the map and it's going to be sheriff a sheriff versus sheriff a sheriff you know what i'm saying and it's going to be that little ratatouille he's going to take out the stand of mini moons but it's going to be a blood elf massacre let's drop the terrence and philip what does he have is it the aerostorm he already used rogue token not too long ago guess we'll go ah, da, 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 and chop him down Sheriff Cartman was going to die anyway from that. And that's going to be that first candy bar. I mean, that first game. <laughs> and three candy bars. You know what I'm saying? De Professor says, Chaos is 2963. I think he was. And said, how far is Mimby? And, no, yes, that you're correct, Professor. And after we get 12 more, it'll be 2975. Monka said, why are people still playing Rogue in challenges? Who knows? All right, all right, all right, all right. So let's refresh the game real quick as it has no sound. Should have caught that before we started the stream, but lo and behold, I missed it. What do you know? Lo and behold, but we did secure that first victory. Logging in, can we get a sound check? Hey, hey. Professor K said, nice Yoshi. Oh, Yoshi said, hey, I got a Medusa Bebe in the Priest Maxi event. Did you really? That's awesome. I think that event secured a lot of people some some sweet legendary loot. I'm pretty sure uh, it seemed like it. Roger Dika said, did you see the new episode? Mr. Hanky got killed off the show. Yeah, I did watch it, and I'm, I feel like he's going to make a comeback later on in the season. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, they're kicking him out now, but he'll be back. He'll be back. And audio check confirmed. Don King Butters is a squealing. So that means we are a go. For our second round of the challenge mode. Let's go. What's up, F Meister? How's it going, buddy? Wesley Lopes says, hi, man. That's challenger is great. Yes, the challenge mode is pretty good, Lopes. Indeed. Nice to see you there. Chucky e. Cheese says, I got A, and then he didn't say anything else after that. He's got A, what do you know? A. Hey. 
Gonna be that rock solid dog 607 from Skank Hunt 42. Professor said I keep punching butters because he won't give me dog poo. Ooh, that makes perfect sense actually. Let's start off with the Sheriff Carmen. Perfect for these chickens. The chicken salata. Salata. We've got the Blood Elf Baby ready to go. I think this should be a no problemo. We drop the PC principal. Instantly being able to protect our NK there. And he's gonna have the chickens galore. Put in some work though. Maybe we should have had a Aerostorm here instead. As he takes the bar, we could be in trouble. That chicken could put in the work. Chicken putting in the work, man. Aerostorm right meow. And it wasn't enough to take out the Canadian Night Ike. Although maybe the Zapper could have it if I had waited just a moment there, but he's easily got the second bar. I do believe this is going to be a difficult one, bro. Can the hook hand caught hit that Blood Elf Baby? It goes long and wrong. That Paladin Butters and Blood Elf Baby gonna take us out in a hurry. We are two bars behind, and that Blood Elf Baby getting stronger by the moment. I will bring you down. Oh my, that's GG. She one shot us, boys. That's GG. Good game. We got three. Oh, Captain Diabetes says, I got dog poo in my shop. Roger Dika says, I have level five, Mimsy. There you go. So that will be our first loss. It is one, one, and we've got 11 more matches to go. Can we finish this? Yumanko said, I'm always punching Cartman after I open free packs and getting labard all the time. <laughs> What do you know about that? All right, let's get it, let's get it. Let's not stop. Dimanka says, Belf is best card for this week challenge. She is a beast. Evman said, it'll come to you, Chaos, when you least expect it. There you go. That's right. That's exactly right. Do 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 do. No worries about a thing. What's up, Roxo817 says, hey, hey, hello, everyone. Professor, I think they opened closed beta, so they don't have to test. Huh? Maybe. 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 We've got Torlugic420. Let's go. What a super L super beast he is. I'm gonna have to drop that PC Just principle all up in it. Students, get ready to be school. We know the Nathan gonna put some lethal damage in here if we do not act fast. But we can get him targeted down in a hurry. She takes the hit, but it, she's unable to acquit. We can drop an Ike in here. He's gonna get that shield looking good. Going in clean, 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 clean. And he takes out the... It's the token, and it looks like we've got this candy bar in the bag. Looking for a hook forward hook hand Clyde. Lobster. I mean, a, not lobster. It's a parrot. It's a parrot, man. And he tags. Bag him and tag him, boys. Taking that second candy bar. We're going to start off with the stand of many moons. Prepping for another push. Going in for that third candy bar. Looking like he's ready to defend with the Marine Craig. And three, two, one, make them boom, baby. Drop the butters, followed by a Princess Kenny. And that should be GG. Roger Dika says, oh my, a lot of letters. A Biogenesis Gaming, what's up, buddy? How's it going? Professor says, well, gotta go. See you later. Have a good day. Wendy Malasquez Santos says, hello, guys. Welcome back, welcome back. <laughs> that will secure our second match of the run with one loss. Let's go ahead and open up this first PvP pack of the day. What do you say? You say visual bug. Ooh la la. Three hundred and thirty PvP tickets, one cash money, plenty of upgrades, and you know it. Those Zenny Zens coming in. No Menzies. How could they do this to us? Let's go ahead and refresh for that second PvP pack of the day and get into that 
Well, it'll be the fourth match, I guess, actually. The fourth match of the run. Roger Dickens says, I only play fantasy deck. Jay Rage says, what up, Hayes? Go get those 12 wins. Let's go. Feeling the good vibes. Aloy says, Hayes Tally. Let's drop those Hayes Tallies in the chat. Drop them if you got them. See, F Meister already did as well. He knows all about it. Captain Diabetes says, did you hear that there is going to be a new theme? Uh, no. As far as I know, there is no uh, nothing official about a new theme. There's only fan theory. Fan theory. We've got content traded for 20 donations. Fan theory and fan created. There is nothing else other than the original. Let's start off with the PC principle all the way in the back. Far too many micro transgressions. I think if we just sit back, relax, throw a hook hand Clyde all the way in the back. He hits that that sweet shot, Cotman. And we'll go ahead and throw out the Santa Mini Moon and get ready to go full frontal. Oh, he drops the arrow storm, but it's not gonna be enough damage. Here comes the burn, baby. And we've got the twin brothers, that Terrence and Felipe. Here comes a Cyborg Kenny to take over my Santa Mini Moon, but he's taken down so quickly, it's ridiculous. 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 One foul mistake and you shall prove to be at a loss here as we will concentrate this evil directly into him which is this wombo combo of triple assassin which we really didn't even need the third one there and that is going to be that second candy bar is our opponent ready to gg we could throw the pc principle and see what would happen but let's wait just a moment do we create a fan theme dark theme halloween theme yolo theme Mr. Miller cannot understand what you said there. A lawyer says, Hayes Princess. There you go. Also, Galinda says, Yo, what's up, Hayes Demon? The Mimthy count up to. Once we finish our current request, it will be. Oh, the lightning bolt definitely was unnecessary there. The hook hand Clyde. Hit him. Actually hit him, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Let's drop that arrow storm. May not be enough here in time for PC Principal Survival. 58 seconds remaining. Let's drop that Sheriff Carmen. I think we can still go in for the candy bar, actually. Oh, Sheriff Carmen actually gets taken down by the dog dog poo in a 1v1 scenario. Sally putting in the twerk. It's gonna be the arrow storm. And the shield going on to the Terrence. Or the Yeah, the Terrence. And it's gonna be Princess Kenny taking that last candy bar. GG. Good game. FLFR said this games are worse than I thought. A Biogen says swapped him in the deck for SNR. Oh wait, let's see. Says, oh last night I got sixth element Randy to level three. Did you really? Dude, I can't wait to get Six Element Randy to level 3. He's such a beast. Mr. Miller said, Hayes, hello in Russian. Oh, what's up, Mr. Miller, yet again? I, I see, I've seen your comment there, but now I can understand what you're saying. Thank Welcome to the channel, Mr. Miller. So a Bio said he switched him in instead of Sexy on Randy. That makes perfect sense. Perfect sense. So far, oh yeah, uh, if my said, hi, Miller. Gui Chris says, if a fun game. All right, let's go in for that fifth match. That fifth match because we have lost one already. Oh, look who it is, it's Blades. What's up, guy, he says. How's it going, buddy? Mr. Ninth Army in here as well. Jay Rich says, the only theme I wanna see is the superhero theme. The one from Fractured Butthole. That makes perfect sense. Makes perfect sense, man. I would like to have both of them, honestly. I think... Oh, what's up, Fabian Taylor? Nice to see you in the chat, buddy. There you go. Where'd the ship go from the... Scrut, scrut? You know what I'm saying. Fabian in the house. Witch Doctor, Tendula says, Hey, guys. Hey, hey, guys. 
Let's drop the hook hand Clyde as well. That collects a Ruski, denying him hitting one of my units. Guaranteed, basically. You know what I'm saying. Oh, he's gonna get the freeze in here, but it's not gonna work. There's no way. Oh, the du oh the Dougie actually put in so much damage. That is ridiculous. Does he have the Aerostorm? He has a Cyborg Kenny. And our Princess Kenny's gonna take over our entire field. I'm waiting for that Aerostorm. I'm not seeing it, though. I think Terrence and Philip can do this. Maybe a special lightning bolt in there for... Wait, nope, 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 nope. Let's get that Standing Mini Moons out there, because we're going in for that second candy bar. All right, there's far too many microaggressions happening here. Let's go. Prep and roll out. The mind control gonna make Ooh, us explode. But PC Principal does not give a what what about that. Ooh, just in the nick of time, ours turn our Stand of Mini Moon turns back onto our side. Ooh, and Stand of Mini Moon's able to hit Ike without taking the damage. The BM from that Stand of Mini Moons is too strong. Let's get that burst out there, even though he could have just hit the NK, but. He needed to do it just for the lulls. You know what I'm saying? The lulls. We hit the NK there instead with the lightning bolt. Did not kill Dog Poo. Now we're going to go ahead and do the Wombo combo. It'll work here perfectly. Wombo combo. You know what I'm saying? And it's going to be GG. Good game. What's up, Giovanni Bonilla says, hi everybody, good game. Good game, bro. And Sneaky YT in here as well. What's up, everybody? We looking good in the chat today, hey. Loving it. Taco Taco 2 says, hey everyone, how we all doing today? Galinda said, what's the move I was running? Demaka said, yeah, Fireball is better this challenge, hmm. I just, uh, not, I'm just, I mean, I like Fireball, I'm just not a huge fan. I kind of feel like Stand and Many Moons can do the job, or put the pressure on my opponent to waste some energy in there, too. But you guys want that Fireball. Plus, sometimes you can accidentally use Fireball very badly. If I said Rugrats is the shiznit, you know it like that Popeyes. <laughs> Sneaky says, we should give Hayes the 12-0 deck FM. Oh, Llama Cartman's cat. I do like to play my own deck, as you know it. <laughs> Show it should. Oh, the llama saying, hi, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go with the bang, bang. Thank you, ma'am. We can get that Sheriff Cartman build up some energy here to blast them down. He's got the hook hand Clyde out there. It goes wide. Does he have the arrow storm? We can hold on to Cartman's ability here and save it for a uh, NK hit. Actually, it could just hit these two units here, no problemo. Putting some pressure onto our opponent with our units. We can go ahead and put out the Stand of Many Moons onto the field. Calamity Heidi here should be able to hold it down just long enough to be able to get the burst out. She's able to block the ability, and they survive, but Blood Elf Bebe ready here to bring the Reckoning. That Reckoning. Can we get the Terrence and Philip out in time? Or should we just let her put the pressure down? We'll go ahead and do the Terrence and Philip. They're definitely not gonna make it there to save her. Since it's a 1v1 scenario, but they take each other out. Let's go ahead and do the Wombo combo. We've got that Paladin Butters, Princess Kenny. We don't even need to put in the Paladin Butters as Terrence and Philip did more than enough damage and looking to secure that second candy bar. One minute and 30 seconds. Can we bring in the third one? What's up, Witch Doctor says, how are you guys? He says, I already had said what's up, but he says, how are you guys? Woodland says, the new SP episode was sad at the end. Yes, it was. You are correct. Let's go ahead and drop that lightning bolt right on him. PC principal for the front line. This game is offensive and you should all know better. Can we get a Princess Kinney in here? He should be able to counter the Princess Kinney in this current situation. No, he puts Paladin Butters down instead. There is the counter. PC Principal gonna put that on lockdown. One hit, two hits, baby. Come on, let's go. 50 seconds remaining, and our opponent is looking for the rebound to get at least one candy bar. 
Can we get Blood Up Baby out here? She will secure the kills here, guaranteed. Putting down the pain. The Lightning Bolt, though, and we should have dropped the, uh... I go to sit up right there and get they get the bar, but that's okay. No big dealio. No big dealio at all. Take flight. Let's go ahead and get this bar. Let's get this bar, boys. Come on, let's get it. So close. Oh, we were unable to get it. All right, GG, GG, GG. said, what's Gooch Haze? Sean O says, I like the deck haze. Well played, sir. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. It is a fun one, indeed. Sneaky says, Hayes, I know a 12-0 deck that will make you LOL, but it's OP AF for this challenge. <laughs> I'm not quite sure, but I'm sure we could take out Sheriff Cartman and put something in better, to be honest. Well, let's go ahead and open up the second PvP pack of the day. What do you say? You say, can you dig it, baby? Let's go. Can we get the final program, Stan? Can we get them 25 copies of Mamsie? 311 PvP tickets. Cyborg Every Kenny. Time I kick cow's ass. That's good. Now open some more. Four times that Mamsie. Gonna bring us to 21 more copies left and yes I can do math it's just because we're in the middle of a request so we'll already get more copies it's uh was 25 left plus four I mean minus four so it's 21 so we're gonna go ahead and go for that third PvP pack of the day let's go Bishop Grant says leave chicken foot Nancy says regrets is shit compared to other 90s series but good in terms of today's children's show hmm Rugrats was good. It was like an adventure, you know what I mean? They had an adventure on every episode, and one of my favorite episodes that will always stick to me for Rugrats was the episode about Chucky and his fear to go down a slide. Of all things, to be able to not be able to go down a slide. So he was repeating this phrase over and over again to make himself stronger. I'm a big brave dog. I'm a big brave dog. I'm a big brave dog. And he was able to accomplish his goal of sliding down the slide. Isn't that just wonderful? He was able to overcome his challenge by, you know, chanting this 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 encouragement that he thought to himself. Well, his him and his friends, I believe, you know, made it up. But anyway, let's go ahead and go into this next match. And would you believe it? I actually used this chant one time whenever I was in the army and I was practicing shooting my rifle for qualification. I said it to myself to calm myself down and it really does work. <laughs> Let me tell you, pretty cool. Pretty cool. But there's a pretty good amount of episodes in there that I do like that I can't really remember off the top of my head. But we've got Warsamel Sempre. So, Sempre. I do believe it said. Let's get it says, if anyone ruins the new episode for me, someone's getting a serious exotic yeti. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Walter Glenn said, I want to run level 7 shaman token. That would be a beast. I mean, uh... Well, I mean, it would be good, yeah. I'm, it's just right now, like, the poison meta isn't too strong. And... Hmm. I mean, it would work for mind control to help out a lot. I'm trying to get some some love in here with the Princess Kenny here, but I think that the um, yeah, that Medusa Bebe was doing a lot of work there, a lot of work. I'm not sure the Aerostorm would have been enough here. He is able to take the bar though, but we didn't lose a unit. Medusa Bebe putting in some work here, no doubt about it, no doubt about it. But I think we can still make the comeback here with our Blood Out Bebe. What does he have for the AoE defense? He does not have anything for the AoE defense. Our Blood Out Bebe survives as well as our Philip and Heidi. Philip takes the bar. We are actually able to kill the Pope Timmy with the Hook Hand Clyde Clutch. Looking to go in for the third and final candy bar with a lightning bolt. Lightning Bolt, come on baby, Lightning Bolt! And Blood Elf Baby gonna finish this game, GG. Good game. Bishop Graham says, hey hey, whoops. Victor Diaz says, she made it windy and Kyle of Joe Elves did pretty well for me in this challenge. 
Wouldn't doubt it. Sounds pretty good. Yum Yum says, what's up, Hayes and Chaps? Jose Zaragoza said, I did a, just did a 12-0 run, three bar, everyone lost a few bars, and didn't break top 50. Wow. It's that hard to get into the fit top 50 right now, huh? Because that sounds like a pretty good run. Huh. <laughs> Dimanco says, I really want to know how fast this first guy finishes his runs. Oh, right? The guy that um, beat me, I think you're trying to talk about it, I believe. <laughs> Yum Yum says, what run are you on, Hayes? This is my first run of the day. First run of the challenge mode. Walter Glenda said, Medusa putting in the damage. Yes, she was. Walter Glenda said, overspent on the first bar. Uh, maybe they did. Maybe they did. My Terrence and Philip were able to survive uh, without actually taking damage from his units, even though I didn't defend. But... I didn't waste the energy trying to defend because I, I I accidentally kept him alive. I'll be honest, right? I, I put him in late on purpose, but it was too late. But it was late enough that they were still good to work into the next the comeback there. You know what I'm saying? We've got Pamper the Unicorn from Abominations. Or the Unique Conqueror. Pamper the Unique Conqueror. It's gonna be that Mecha Tim's. Mechatom. What do we do versus a Mechatom? The mind control on our Princess Kenny should be timed out perfectly to turn around and attack that. I or Sally, we actually get end up getting hit by the uh, by the Princess Kenny there. I mean, I we're sneaking in an Ike here. I think he might get my or mind control. No, he's looking to get the NK damage. Lightning bolt on the. Mechatimmy just in time to take him down before he takes over my Philip, and it's gonna be that first candy bar. There you go, my Ego, one or fifty percent chance that he's going to be able to defend. Now he has no way to survive as we go in for that second candy bar. And it's actually gonna be that third candy bar. You know what I'm saying? Third candy bar, can you dig it, baby? Let's go, Lego, my ego. We ready to get it and win it. GG. Good game. And the Blood Elf Bebe doing nothing but just ripping them down. Jamaka says, Jose Zaragoza, he can't lose a bar, man. That's very true. I did lose a bar already, uh, besides my loss. But in the other one, I'm not really too worried about it, though. Just want to get the 12 wins. That's the most important thing for me right now. Get that 12 wins. Jose says, haha, it wasn't easy. Walter Glenn said, to get in top 50, it's more important to get all three telephones fast, even if you lose one fight. I finished 35 two events ago. Ooh. We got seven wins so far with one loss. Can we bring it home? Can we get the 12 and one at 12 and at two? You know what I mean. One or the other, but we've got to get that finale i would like to get whatever whatever is available oh it's father maxis we, we can get some father maxis you know what i'm saying yeah we can get some father maxis that's right we got blend from timmy question mark timmy is my old team before i had ever joined the mercenaries although it was timmy exclamation mark but the timmy question mark is the one who lives on through the fire and the flame and it's going to be that chicken coop i would like to see if we could accidentally hit the chicken coop here the trolls are real, boys. Let's go. The cyborg Kenny comes out and gets the mind control on a pallet and butter that goes down. We've got the blood elf baby ready to lock and load on to that Kyle. And we take him down. He actually gets knocked back by the PC principal and then dies in a fiery flame. We've got the PC. Are they, uh... Terrence and Phil going in right behind the PC principal, and we're gonna go in for the second candy bar in here in just a moment. Can you dig it, baby? Lock and load. The Blood Elf baby gonna probably take out the Ike actually before he's able to. We may have overstepped our boundaries here. Uh, although our Blood Elf baby putting in some work here, his Blood Elf baby living la vida loca there. We definitely overstepped for that second one, no doubt about it. Let's not let her lock onto the NK for very long. One hit, and it could be fatality. Oh, she gets two hits. She put in the work. Let's go ahead and drop the stand of mini moons onto the field and get ready for our counter push. He's got plenty of energy, but does he have 
The hustle, the hassle. The whoa. Fireball, please. We can get mind controlled here. Not a problem. PC principal, knock him back. Maybe we can keep him alive. Probably not, though. Yep. <laughs> but he did his job. He did the job he needed to. Forward hook hand clad. Can we get that 50 50 chance on the chicken coop? Yet again, it's a no. The parrot goes flying into the air. That was absolutely hilarious. Hook hand clad doesn't care about it at all, though, as it's going to be that rip for Ronies. Oh, Paladin Butters goes down to the Princess Kinney. We take down the chicken coop, and it's Hook Hand Clyde locked on to that NK. Rip a Ronies, but he was able to do a decent job there. Looks like it's going to be it's Sheriff Cartman champion. for the Twins. This planet is mine. Ah, yeah. oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 he says. And it's going to be the little... Ratatouille's, and we're gonna go in for that Wombo combo. Bringing them down, and that's gonna be that candy bar. We're going in for the third. Can you dig it, baby? Living la vida loca. Princess Kenny, can she survive long enough to get her ability? Now, actually, it was just Blood Elf Baby all the way, baby. Get a little PC. Far too many microaggressions, Far too many boys. Far too many. Squad parents, barely on parents. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Chocolate shake. Chocolate shake. Chocolate shake. Chocolate shake. All right, let's go ahead and open up that third PVP pack of the day. Can you dig it, baby? Bird says her and TNP are a beast in the challenge. Caden Waddington says hi, had a bad day, ooh. Hate to hear that, man. I hope it gets better for you. What's up, Slavius? He says, Hayes with the hugs. Dude, what's up, man? I haven't seen you in the chat in forever. Good to see you here. What's up? Uh, Nyanjinski as well says, I didn't do well in the challenge. I guess assassins would be best for this. So adventure props, but I use my own deck. Don't really care much. It was 3-3, my worst yet. Oh. Whale now. Rare, that's a start. Alrighty, so let's get started on the fourth PvP pack of the day. What's up, Pillager30? He says, what up, Hayes? How the challenge treating you so far? It's treating me pretty good right now. We are 8 and 1. Let's not jinx it. We still have the struggle yet to come. And we've got to be able to handle this business. Sneaky says, how ironic it is. I have 800 cash and my daily deal is 800. Question mark. Minus... 2000 for the daily deal, but I do not have the money for it. It is an Inuit Kenny. I kind of wish I could get him, but you know what I'm saying. We only got that thousand cash money right now. And we're looking to at least play this event one more time. We got El Capitan Ernesto from Raw Resistance. Terrence and Philip, not the best start. But we can make it up with a hook hand clad clutch Ruski. Looks like we've hit the D ranker limit. I am immortal. I right. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Boom, baby, you're gonna knock him out instantaneously. That shield's gonna go on to the hook hand clad. He's gonna be able to take down the Princess Kenny in no problemo. Barely an inconvenience. We've got that PC principal front and center to protect our stand of many moons. Looking to go for the second candy bar in just a moment. It's going to be that hot and heavy explosion. Going to be able to take down the hook and clad. No, not in time. But the princess, can he going to die on him? The ability to attack us. And that's going to be that second candy bar. It's going to be PC principal going in to finish the game. Can we get it? Just one more shot left. It's so close. Ooh, we got it. Going to be GG. Kaden Waddington says, I watch your vids 24-7. Hey, that's what's up, Kaden. That's what's up, man. Good to know. Appreciate the support. Any of it matters, man. Any and all support, subscriptions, sponsorships, you name it. The view, the being here during the live, commenting just one time to say hello. Every little bit 
matters, as it makes it all so much more wonderful for you guys, for me, should I say, to be able to do it for you guys. We are, mm, we are eight months into this bad boy and doing good because we just recently broke 1,300 subscribers yesterday, I do believe. It's going to be that 9 out of 12. We have two lives remaining. Can we bring home the bacon? Walter Lotus said, at Slavius, glad to see you playing competitively again, man. Good luck this season. Pillager 30 says, what up, hey, Tug Chunk, I think I read that. Uh, doing good, doing good. It's doing fairly well so far, indeed. It's gonna be that kink 81 from... I couldn't read the name there fast enough. Looking... Hypnotic says, LOL Slavis is still a thing. Yes, he is. He's a bad boy for life. Bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. We're gonna slow down this high ED just a little bit. It doesn't matter if it hits this guy or that guy. It's all in the hips. It's all in the hips. Aerostorm for the win! He's gonna put in the torque! The shield's gonna make it too good! Too good, baby! That Blood Elf baby about to super soak it up! Super soak it up, baby! Actually, Ike already ready to lock and drop them, both bop them. And it's gonna be that candy bar! I think our Terrence and Philip can take out the Terrence and Philip and no problemo. Barely an inconvenience. With three, two, one, Fartoruski! Fart for everybody! And our one little Terrence is able to survive. He's got the chicken coop on point. Let's get the Stand of Many Moons out. Will our Stand of Many Moons be able to do his damage or will our opponent have the lightning bolt, fireball, mind control, whatever it is ready? Will he have it ready in time? The chicken blocking. It's cock blocking if he had mind control. All right, and it's gonna be too many, too few, and gone. You know what I'm saying? Heidi gonna make sure she doesn't even get one hit in there. Heidi Paladin, um, I don't know. I don't think we need a Paladin just yet. Let's wait just a moment. One minute and 20 seconds remaining. We're ready to get pumped up. Caden says, how was your day, Haze Demon? It is going pretty damn good. You know what I'm saying? Taco Taco says, this game might be death, dead after me if I get my hands on Battle BO4 Blackout Blackout Black Ops 4. There you go. Dude, Black Ops 4, Black Ops 4 is gonna be awesome. It comes out tonight, and I cannot wait to be able to play some Blackout. You know, play some Battle Royale. He's gonna put the freezes in. The freezes, man. Super freeze. Super freeze. The quadruple freeze. Transmortification on our. Blood Elf, baby. There comes that freeze, baby. Let's go. We're going in. 35 seconds remaining. And we're all a nah, y'all. You know what I'm saying? All or nah, y'all. It looks like Cartman accidentally going the wrong direction there. We needed his support for the front line. Our front line actually succeeding to get even a little bit farther. And it's going to be GG. Or can we get in there to get the last bar in time? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, get out of the way, you. Good game, good game, good game, Kink. Good game, we got the bar there. Taka Taka says, I'm about all about the zombies. Can't wait. Zombies will be fun, too. Honestly, I haven't played some good zombies in a long time. In a long time. So, you know what? It would be really refreshing to play some new, uh, new zombie mode. You know what I mean? That would be pretty cool. Dano says, this commentary is awesome. You would think this is a live international sporting event. Really, Dano? Really, really. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it, man. That's what I like to hear. Very awesome. Makes me happy, man. We've got the 10 out of 12 games. One loss, two lives remaining. And a little bit of product placement. You know what I'm saying? We're going in for that 11th game, or technically 12th game, because we lost one, so it's 12th game. If my said, well played, 
Thank you, thank you. 45 minutes into the stream, and we are locked and loaded to try to finish this event. Or our first challenge run with no problemo. Once we run this challenge, we're gonna switch it up to adventure sci-fi because I like to play sci-fi, and adventure is really reliable in this mode. I'm pretty sure <laughs> it's gonna be Putt Monster from Mary Jane's Room. Oh my, what a monstrous name! What a monstrous name indeed. Sheriff Cartman all the way front and center. He's got the Cyborg Kenny. It's Aerostorm. Oh, we didn't get the Aerostorm on the Cyborg Kenny in time. I tried it to drop it fast enough there. But should be okie dokies. This pallet, this uh, astronaut butter is not going to put any damage in there. Although, we almost bit the bullet there as we put down our units a little bit too quick. Pallet and butter is already locked onto the NK. Ain't going to take that candy bar. Return that favor. No problemo. No problemo. He's got the the Ratatouille's. The Ratatouille's and Terrence and Philip. Or the Rat the Terrence and Philip should be able to handle the Ratatouille's and the Hook Hand Clyde, who goes down rather quickly there, I might say. A da sai indeed, Belvedere. I think he's looking to try to sneak in an attack here by if we underestimate one of his characters with his lightning bolt, you know what I'm saying? I'm feeling that kind of groove right now. But it looks like the Terrence Phillips is going to take that second candy bar. PC Principal taking the hit from the bar, though. We've got Stand Many Moons out, and it could be the bar for our opponent. Doo -doo. Come on, Ike. Oh, he gets the bar. He gets the bar. It's one to two. And the Mind Control is going to hit our Stand Many Moons. Oh, no. He hits the ability off and takes all of our units down and it looks like we're gonna get standing mini moons back on our side in just a moment and we're gonna return the favor in triple if you know what i'm saying oh my but the oh here he goes we're gonna get that last candy bar and that's gonna be gg good game pot monster getting that candy bar from us indeed Kakutesko said damn haze you slain this challenge gg hypnotic said 71 live views that's the first one that's the first one, uh, Hypnotic. What do you mean that's the first one? Um, we actually hit 99 viewers on Sunday, this past Sunday. So close to breaking 100. It was ridiculous. So awesome. It was around 12.45 p.m. Sunday. Well, my time, Eastern. So let's go ahead and open up this fourth PvP pack of the day. Can you dig it, baby? Demonko says, final boss, let's go. That's right, that's right, you're right. 291 PvP tickets. Them sweet outlaw tweaks. <laughs> that's good, now open some more. Whoa, nice rare. Mm -mm -mm. And we're gonna get started on the fifth PvP pack of the day. Have no fear, PvP Pac-Man is here. <laughs> PvP Pac-Man. PvP Pac-Man at it again. All right. We are 11 and one. One match remaining. Two lives remaining. We could take a complete zero and three and come back with another chance to win it. But we are here now to finish it up and get those 12 open up. Get some free Mac. Well, they're, well yeah, they're free because it's a free challenge mode. So free Maxis. You know what I'm saying. Hy Hypnotic says, haven't seen much of anyone's streams. To be honest, I've been working as an operator. I guess I won't see streams at all from this coming Monday. Oh, well, good luck on your job. That's good to know that you are moving on up to the east side. We've got Porkala Kong Chetu from Latinos Pro. Porkala Kong Chetu He drops the unit, it's gonna be that hook hand Clyde lot of fast. 50 50 chance, it hits that tally. Hook line and tally later. Tally later, boys. The sheriff in town, his name is Cotman Bra. His ability was actually not enough to do enough damage there against Princess Kenny. We can get that. PC Principal out in time. It's barely enough, and it's able to keep her alive, though. That's all that matters. 
She's gonna lock and load on that BHK. Gonna be that first candy bar coming at you in three million, two million, one million, gazillion. It's gonna be that Terrence and Philip though. Ooh. But we've got our own Terrence and Philip for the job of Supreme Being. The dead farce coming out of that Terrence was ridiculous. But here comes that candy bar. There we go. Boom shakalaka. And we're gonna drop the hook hand Clyde for the fitty fitty. Show me something sweet. Show me something good to eat. One in three chance. And it's a absolute miss there. But I think we've got a Ike that can potentially do the damage here. No. Our opponent's gonna take that candy bar. No problemo. No problemo. He drops another unit. Could be trouble here with Princess Kenny on the field. Oh, oh, our Blood Elf Bebe, though. She's gonna get the hits that make them quits. Potentially. Potentially. Oh, it's a DKC, though. Our opponent's playing the DKC strategy. I think Sheriff Cartman's the best choice here, so that way he is less likely to be killed during the trade. Mecha Timmy on board. We've got that lightning bolt for him automatically. Automatically. Stana Mini Moons. Let's get ours on the field. Sheriff Cartman's ability is not as strong as I thought it would be. But it puts in some work here. Just barely. Not enough though. The Ratatouille's coming out and the Fireball. Not enough. He takes us down with the freeze. It's Paladin Butters locked onto the NK. He takes the candy bar. But we're gonna go in for the one of our own. Paladin Butters, Princess Kenny, Wombo combo. However, they get taken down at the exact same time. Not gonna work out the same. 18 seconds remaining. I think that's gonna be GG. Students, get ready to be school. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, GG. <laughs> Good game. Caesar Marin says hi. Caesar says, what's up, Hayes? What do you think about the dark theme? I think it would be very awesome. There's a lot of great card ideas. Demonka says, GG, you won no meta deck. Yeah, and then we lose, right? <laughs> Stan Mar says, I have to prepare for my exam in grade 10 piano this year. Whoa. Piano, that's a difficult to learn for sure, no doubt about it. So good luck on that for sure. I'm trying to donate here and it throws me away. We don't have nothing to donate there. We have 11 wins, two losses, one more match to go. Can we do it? Let's bring it home. Come on. Come on. We got this. We got this. Flameberg says the general fire is so close. Dimanco said he played that really well. F is saying Ripperonies. Woodland Critter says, gotta go, have a good day, everybody. Have a wonderful day. Woodland Critters. Fabian Taylor says, we're in trouble, make it double. <laughs> there you go. Ain't no doubt about it, I can't stop saying that. We've got Wrecking Libra, 18 from Gamer's Revenge. Gamer's Revenge, this is the true final boss. Are we able to bring it home? It's gonna be that energy staff and a sexy nun Randy. He's gonna put in everything he's got for the W, as well as we will. Come on, Sheriff Cartman, don't let me, don't fail me now. We've got our standing many moves on the field. Not gonna be enough. Well, actually, we even were able to take down the energy staff, even if it might've had a little bit of health. All that matters is that we were able to negate it, getting all of its energy. It looks like we're able to take the first candy bar down, the shield going on to our Blood Elf Baby, but we really need to keep our Stand of Many Moons alive. We're putting the Princess Kenny into the front of him, and that's protection, and gonna be that second candy bar. Somehow our Blood Elf Bebe survives. He's got the Father Maxi level two. I think this is gonna be good game. We're going in for the third and final candy bar. Hallelujah. Hallelujah! Yep, that's gonna be GG, boys. GG, good game. Our second to last opponent was truly the final boss. Of wrecking wrecking uh, had a little bit lower level deck. You know what I'm saying? Fubuki said, wow. Alexander Dwalt says, my important question, where is Mimsy? Mimsy, we're playing challenge mode right now, and Mimsy's not exactly 
the best in challenge mode. It is cool idea to play him, but there's a really good chance that you'll lose with him. With them doing double damage, the assassins will eat him alive. Eat him alive, boys. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. We're stuck. Okay. We're not stuck. Flamberg says OWO. Two loses, two losses, and 11 wins. OWO. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Demonka said GG. F Meister with the, the uh, Joker Mimsy. I'm going to throw a Joker Mimsy in there as well. Flamberg says GG. 12 wins. QWQ. All right. Let's go ahead and open up. These pack of Ruskies. Little cat dog, cat dog, come on now, cat dog, wow, wow. Get a little, we gotta sing this song, cat dog, wow, wow. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Thank you all so very much. We were able to do this graciously. Although we had two losses, it was just enough to be able to finish it up and get that 12 wins by the skin of our teeth. The game being gracious enough to, to to put a lower level player on the table for us to just gobble up. No, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. May not be the most climatic event, but... We put on the show, you know what I'm saying. Alright, let's go ahead and open up the card packs. It says chance for maxis. How many maxis are we gonna get? How many? Got a little song, got, got sing song, cut dough, wow, wow. Look at that, Robin Tweak of 712. Really, I wish I had more Canadian Night Hikes right now. There, that's it. We there. want you. That's Looks it. like we got no maxis out of that one. Zero. Chance for a new card. There are two. That's good. Now open some more. There we go. Times one, Father Maxi. Whoa, nice rare. Okay, you're a little bit lucky. A rare? Save that for later. That second to last guaranteed yet again as well. Shall we proceed? Rare? Keep going, new kid. Ooh, 98 out of 8 cubic carbons. We need to level that bad boy up. It's Step a sexy it. I mean, nun, Randy. No 20 out of 100. Like Looking pretty juicy. Rare two times play. lightning bolt for the donation. It's gonna be two times priest maxi. More rare than a common, right? Oh, my leg. Do through much? Oh, Dexter. French is the language of love. If my said I was double checking to see if you could use the emotes in SMS on iPhone like Twitch, but no. Oh, I see what you're saying. Alright, let's see what we get in this final pack. Will it be something good to eat three times? That's Priest Maxi. Very good. Nice. A rare. That's good. Now open some more. 885 Labard Jimmies. Ridiculous. That's going to be our rewards for that run. We will go ahead and refresh the deck we're gonna change it to that adventure sci-fi or is it fantasy sci-fi just kidding of course it's adventure sci-fi because we need lightning bolt it's like the main thing aerostorm kind of yeah 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 but 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 look at that there's only three cards from that <laughs> from that theme Kind of funny. 
Enforcer Jimmy puts in such good work as well. We don't get as powerful of assassins though. The uh, Paladin Butters and Princess Kinney put in a lot of extra damage to our opponents compared to uh, Ike and Astronaut Butters and Sally. I feel like we should run Sally instead of Astro just because... Because... Astro has a slower attack and he got nerfed a little bit more. So he would be less efficient, although his speed boost would be proficient. But I think that's all we need to do to change up the deck to make it sci-fi. Sci-fi fantastic. Oh yeah, we can take out Sheriff Cartman actually. We can take out Sheriff Cartman and put in Alien Clyde. We can run the Double Clyde, no doubt about it. Love me some Double Clyde. That Double Clutcher, Ruski. But we can scan one more time just to make sure that's what I'm feeling the groove for. But I love me some Insta Killers. We could run the Mecha Timmy, but eh, you know what I'm saying. We already run in Santa Mini Moons. It'd have to be Santa Mini Moons or Mecha Timmy. Not really both. Although both do work. Don't get me wrong there. I think we're good here. Just like that. Do, do. Well, actually, Alien Clyde. Yeah, we could do Alien Clyde still. Yep. Let's see here in chat. What's up, Altar Pena says, Hola, amigo. Fabian says, No BHK. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not so sure about BHK. I mean, I, I guess it does make sense to run him instead of Alien Clyde because he could do a lot more damage. Okay. All right, all right, Fabian, you convinced me, very easily convinced me to play the BHK instead of our, um, our lovely contestant, Alien Clyde, yes. It may be a bit of a gamble, but it will be fun, no doubt about it. Don't you forget about it. Altar Pena says fifth element. Nah, I don't think I would play fifth element in the challenge mode. He's not as viable, I don't believe. We are currently working on our fifth PvP pack of the day. Only one more candy bar to go. We're ready to get this second challenge run on the roll. I made sure to put in Robo Bebe, right? I mean, I forgot to look to make sure. I'm pretty sure I put her in. Roy VIP says, hola, hey, saludos desde Peru. Muy buenos tus videos, bro. Gracias. 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 Victor Diaz says, what would be the visitor's damage in this challenge? I'm not sure. Visitor, I heard visitors were kind of good. What's up, Peter Parker, a.k.a. Spider-Man? Says, hey, Hayes. We got Spidey senses up in here. Taco Taco says, hope you get that pro stand this stream, buddy. We could. We could easily get it in this very next P PvP pack, the fifth one. But we're going to get some more since we're running a second time through the challenge mode. At least... This one more time. We've got Sonaros Sux 37259. Gonna be our first opponent of the match. Always remember the first opponents A are the strongest. You, yes, He's gonna bust out the cow. We're just gonna go ahead and drop that lightning bolt on top of him. Ain't playing no games with that. Ain't playing no games with that cow at all. It's a level one chicken coop as well. I don't believe our opponent has the right cards for this job. We could have probably have just um, played normal cards there, I, I do believe. Let's go ahead and set up the stand of mini moons in the back, looking to get that second candy bar before we've even touched the first candy bar. If you know what I'm saying, gonna rip them a new one right here in three, two, one, let's go! No, we blocked our ability to blow them up. The pigeons! Oh, they're too strong. Let's heal! Heal! Heal, baby! Heal! Heal! Oh, it wasn't enough to keep Stan and Many Moons alive, though. Alright, Heidi. Heidi's a god. She's too smart and way too funny. 
I forgot to see where our uh, position was on the leaderboard, actually. I mean, I don't think that we would have got a really high position on the leaderboard, but I would think that we did uh, pretty decent. I guess we can look at it after this match. Shouldn't. Not, I'm pretty sure I can remember. It's a couple seconds from now. Jay Riz says, Hey, how close is that? Mimsy27. We are 20, currently 21 copies away from level 7 Mimsy. 21 copies, man. We could get it this stream, but even if we did get the 21 copies, I would wait till tomorrow. But if we get Program Stand, if we get one copy of Program Stand today, we will upgrade him to level 5. I was able to get my legendary Man Bear Pig to level 3 on Tuesday during the stream. We actually got Man Bear Pig in a locker. It was so awesome. 290 PvP tickets, 3 cash monies. Those Blood Elf babies looking good. More Hallelujah. Than common, okay, you're a little bit lucky. How close are we to that level 6? A uh, little ways off there. Not too much of in a hurry. I never really was. I've had level 5 poison since like February or March. Probably February. So let's go ahead and refresh this PvP pack for the sixth one. And go ahead and get into that second match of the day. Alter Penny said, well, that was easy. Yes, it was. But it was not our it was not our opponent's fault that it was easy. It was kind of more the matchmaking. But you know how it is. We just it, we just gotta do what we gotta do, they gotta do what they gotta do. And we here to win twelve matches. That tournament style mode. Who's it gonna be for our second opponent of the day? Gonna be God, God Tech from Gayer Than Aids. God Tech. Is that technique? I mean, tech. You know, tech. Yeah, that tech. That tech. Tech. Tick tock. Tech. Tick-tock. Tick. Let's go to Stand Mini Moon. I can see him still using people. something to take out our Stand Mini Moon, though. Alright, let's drop this here. There's the lightning bolt. We knew he was gonna get a little fishy in there. The Blood Elf Bebe ready to put in some work here, but we can and shall and hopefully... Oh no! Oh no! She survives very easily. Sally hopefully gonna be able to take her out. Uh, I guess not. Well, that's gonna be that first candy bar for our opponent. He's looking to go in for the second one. Aerostorm, not gonna be enough damage here, but I'm gonna do it anyway. And that's gonna be GG. Good game. Walter Palindo said, I thought I was going to beat you to level five epic. I'm 10 away from with Hook Hand Clyde and 20 on Dog Poo. Walter Palindo said, congrats on Program Sam. Thank you so very much. Thank you. We're gonna be getting that one pretty quickly. Far too many microaggressions happening here. Pretty soon, I dare say. I dare say. Oh, look at that miss. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day in the neighborhood. For a robo baby to get buffed. Baby, get buffed up. Get buffed up, get buffed up. Get buffed up, get buffed up. We've got one minute and 26 remaining. Seconds for Seconds remaining. He drops the Princess Kenny locked on to our... Oh, oh, the little farts! That could... Can they do it? Unable to take that first bar. We got the standing mini moons on the field for the defense looking to offend. With one minute and four seconds remaining, we are two bars behind. ch 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 chippin Dale. Rescue Ranger! Oh, no, and that's gonna be GG. There's, at this point, there's no way we can make a comeback. I already know we can't get the candy bar with that either. <laughs> but that doesn't mean we can't put that BM right in there, you know what I'm saying? That BM right in there. I think we made the mistake where we had put PC Principal in there to try to kill Blood Elf Bebe. And he ended up knocking her back way out of the range of the fight. Pretty sure. Oh, the little rat putting in the work there. And Catapult gonna finish the game off. 
GG. We already knew it. We were just waiting on it. If he would just hurry up. So we can get to the next match. <laughs> Guess he could have hurried up if I wasn't trying to stop him, I suppose. But in this mode, you're supposed to not let them have any candy bars. I mean, even if you draw. <laughs> Alright, we're one and one. Eleven more matches to go. Kalu Frolix is A. What's up? What are that? What's up with the A, man? A, but of course, what do you know? Ain't nothing but a gangsta party. Kalu Frolix says, like, 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 like a G6. Now feeling so fly, like a G6. You know it, Kalu. We feeling so fly. Alta says, Shiza, it happens. Yeah, it's all good. It's all groovy, baby. We still got two more lives left. Gonna be that Nets fan 27 from member to 90s. Yeah, we member to 90s. We member them 90s. Team member the 90s. The choir boy Butter is gonna put our PC principal down to defend from him. He doesn't get hit by the zapper, meaning he's gonna get another attack in Freelow. Freelow. Let's drop our standing mini moons in the back. Oh my, it's a Hercules Clyde. But he's unable to do the damage he needs to. Our Enforcer Jimmy gonna guarantee that this standing mini moon does not get to use his ability. Okay, Clyde gonna be the denial of all. No. He is not. And this blood elf, I mean this Robo Bebe food coming up to you. Serving up. Serving it up. Alright, don't hit my blood elf baby. Get out of here. Yeah, hell man. We don't want none of that. None of that business up in here. Hook and Clyde looking for the clutch spin to win. Spinning that parrot around and it flies. And it lands on that Medusa Bebe. Terrence and Philip going into the candy bar. Robo Bebe locked on and taking it down. She's gonna go down. Oh no, she survives. Ready to push in yet again. Let's get that bounty hunter Kyle to defend. He can and he shall proceed. Heidi getting that extra damage. Looking to finish off our opponent with the Heidi. And that's gonna be G, G. Walter Glinda said that last one felt fishy. You were really behind on energy the whole match. Huh. Uh, Blood of Bebe just really put in some work for him, I think. It happens. It happens, cotton. Cotton. It happens, cotton. You know what I'm saying? That six PvP pack, we are three out of five. We're on the fourth match of the second run. One loss. Two wins. <laughs> Do the math. Do the math out loud and you will be proud. Unless you say it wrong and you will be frowned on. Frowned on, frowned upon. The Frischtefer, the good Frischtefer. The cloudy with a chance of meatballs, that good Frischtefer. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We got corrupt PvP from Namblitz. Hey! Hey! Whoa! Heidi's, Heidi's looking to tussle. Here we go. Now we've got an increased chance that this hook hand Clyde will do the job he needs to. It hits DNK though. Let's drop an arrow storm way too early. Probably way too early anyway, I need to say. Yeah, way too early. I was right. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it in my bones. I knew it in my soul that it was too soon. Oh, yeah, that's that bar. And you know it. Ooh, we're not looking good here. If we put in too much for the chickens, it could be fatal. Yeah, there. Ooh. Could be trouble. Make it doubly. 
Okay, we put Sally too far back, I think. No, no. Oh, she got taken down. Blood Elf Bebe putting in the work. He takes the second candy bar. One minute and 15 seconds remaining. We've got a Robo Bebe on the loose. He's got the fireball. Gonna take out our Terrence and Philip and the Robo Bebe. That's probably GG. No doubt about it. Good game. That's gonna be our second loss. I do not think we can make the comeback here with one minute and 30 seconds remaining and him getting that juicy hit. Holly won a cracker. It hits our hook hand card and not our standing mini moon. Glorious. Glorious indeed. Do do do. Does he have another fireball? We have the fireball. He takes us down with that Labard Jimmer. And we're looking to go in with the PC principal. Potentially. Oh, no. It's going to be those Terrence and Phillip. Yep, that's game. Good game. Good game. And the Wombo combo. And you know it. Oh, we take him out at the same time, unable to get their combo off and finish up the game. Lightning Bolt for the BM. We already know. Let's continue on. We'll have one life remaining for the second run with only two wins. We are so far away from getting securing our second 12 run win run. The sci-fi not working out in our favor. BHK could potentially be our downfall here. I'm going to go ahead and switch BHK out and put a a bit Fata Bati onto the field. Yep, the hook hand quad. As we were going to do, the hook hand shuffle. I mean, not hook hand quad. The alien clad shuffle. Where will the lobster land? Jay Brian, what do I want to do tonight? <laughs> hey, what's up, Nasty Chicken Foot, with that two. Euro. Well, I think that says Euro. I could be confused, but I'm pretty sure that looks like Euro. Thank you so very much for the super chat. Notification's about to come up in just a moment, but I see it in the chat just a little bit quicker there. Appreciate it, buddy. Bringing that morality up. There it is. That bring. Thank you, bro. It's awesome. Awesome nasty chick for this right. Ooh, and we got a new subscriber to the channel. Who's it gonna be? Hopefully I'll be able to see her in a moment and won't be confused. We've got one legged pigeon from Merc Lords. Used to be Swamp Lords is absolutely awesome team. And it's gonna be Nasty Chicken Foot Resubbin, I think. Oh, do no, donated through the super chat, that's what it was saying. Okay. I think I was getting confused there. Comes that sweet fireball. I bring purity. Oh, oh, we should be okay here. I think PC principal. Paladin, yes, 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 yes. We were able to, to defend the zapper. Whoa. Zapper no zappy. And let's throw the Sally in there. Maybe you have to lightning bolt something here. We get the candy bar. We only got 55 health though. He could easily hit us with something something good here. Walter Glenna said, Labard seems interesting for challenges. Does he kill level four assassins? I think he does. I think he killed ours, but I'm not for sure. Oh, the hook hand card gonna miss. We just throw out the units for the sacrifice, for the slaughter. Will our units be able to pull through to the accidental release? If we can keep standing many moons alive just a little bit longer. Boom, baby! Moon, give me power! He's dropping the triple assassins. It's gonna be that arrow storm. Not necessarily worth it there. Although, 
it drops the field out evenly. He's got the Stana Mini Moons. And we have the Lightning Bolt for him as well. Does our opponent have a follow-up unit? One minute and seven seconds remaining. We are one bar to one bar. Gonna be that Mephisto. We've got the Alien Clod for the counter. That Lobster Dinner. Boom. Terrence gonna go down too quickly. Blood Oath Baby ready. Oh, yeah, Blood Oath Baby almost locked on to the NK there. Very close. Very scary. And here comes the Terrence and Philip. I think we can get the weak one first. Is she gonna be able to get some hits in? No, she goes down. This Ike could be too much trouble for our Enforcer Jimmy. No, we were able to survive there. Princess Kenny in front of Paladin is a good thing. 18 seconds remaining. We just play just a little bit more carefully. Oh, five health remaining. Oh my. Don't let him lock onto the NK. Does he have the energy for a lightning bolt? He does. He does have the energy for a lightning bolt. Sudden death. Let's explode that Heidi. And that's going to be GG. Good game. And it looks like we have a free pack of cards available. <coughs> Nasty Chicken Foot said, I enjoyed your stream and interactions the past weeks, so I wanted you to give you something back. Well, thank you, Nasty Chicken Foot. I appreciate you putting in a, um, a comment to go along with the donation. It, it means a lot to know it, it, why you, you felt that way. And it's, it's really awesome. I, I try to be as interactive as possible with the chat. I mean, sometimes the game, you really get focused into it, and then sometimes it kind of just gets a, you know, a little rough, but I do I do try to stay to it, man. Thank you. We're going to open up that sixth PvP pack of the day. What's up, Mego? Julio666. Lobo 2 Loco says, nice win, Hayes. He's a tough competitor, is he now? He definitely put in some work, no doubt about it. 270 PvP tickets won. Cash money. We have three wins, I do believe, and two losses. Like so I it's looking shout. rough right now. Common, right? All right. Seventh PvP pack of the day coming at you. Mego Julio666 says, smash that like button, guys. That's what's up, Mego. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. All right, this is looking real close, guys. As in, we're very far away, and it's looking real slim. We're just barely floating above water. But can we bring it? Walter said, I renamed my adventure locked girl N.K. Nagini just before the new Harry, or Genie, N Nagini, just before the new Harry Potter hits theaters. Oh, you're talking about Fantastical Beasts Part 2. I'm hoping that'll be good. What's up, Gabriel? One, two, three, three, two, one. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. That name is Hype. That's it. Gabriel's got the Hype name. Let's go. Them Hype boys. Uh, so we're on the fourth icon. But really, it's the sixth match, right? Yep. Got to get our head in the game. We've got Crimson Trader 22 from Hunter Hippies. Altopinia says, I'm still waiting for a mask stream, frowny face. Uh, I may do one Sunday. I may do a panda mask stream Sunday. So if you want to catch that stream, you just might see a panda coming at you. It's going to be that 50-50 chance. Does he hit it? He wings it. Can we get the boom, baby? Moon, give me power. Moon, give me solar power. All right. I squeeze yourself in there somehow. Oh. Pretend like you mean it, boy. Alright, we got Alien Clyde just for this reason. To take down a Nathan with no backlash whatsoever. I love me some Alien Clyde. It's like we have a new subscriber to the channel. Who's it gonna be? Nathan gonna go down with not even one bomb release. Gonna be that... Robo baby, ready to get scooped up and ready to go. Bless you, child. That little assassin, though, is going to put in some work. Nope, never mind. It's about to be taken down. The lightning bolt going to go on what I do not know yet. Oh, we're not going to get it in time. 
It's like I felt it was coming, boys. I knew it. But the PC principle was just too strong. That's gonna be GG. Good game. Kalahon D. Alex, one times nine says, good luck. Thank you. We're looking really close right now. Lizard666 says, love your channel, bro. Hey, thank you, Lizard. The 666, the mark of the beast, that demon slayer lizard. That's what I'm thinking about anyway. Kalahon D. Alex says, papa. Smiley face. Papa. Pada bing. Bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. We are three out of five for that seventh PvP pack of the day. We are four wins, two losses, eight more to go. One life remaining. Can we do it? Can we do it? I dare say I don't really know. Kalahon says GG. Oh, GG. Oh. GG indeed. Can we do it? I fear the Reaper. But they say, don't fear the Reaper. They do say, we are one minute and 26 seconds into the stream. Can you dig it, baby? I mean, one hour and 26 minutes. Gusti says, yo, Hayes, nice game. Hey, GG, bro. Whooping me up, I think that was you. If you were whooping me up, that was definitely what happened there. We got Electric Spider 21 from Wubba Lubba Dub 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 Wubba Lubba Dub 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 It looks like our opponent is dropping all the bombs on the planet and watch them explode. Goosties, just make sure that you you uh, seen you. You said, yo, Hayes, nice game. GG, bro. GG. Can we get something to stop this bounty hunter, Kyle? Or do we even need to? Yeah, we probably do. He's getting boosted in there. Super soaking him. Oh, come on. Robo Baby. She could take the lobster to the face, and she does. Not going to be a successful return there, as she's going to go down. I think our Ike is going to be more than enough damage here to finish off the Alien Clyde. The Zapper should be able to take out this dog poo. So let's go ahead and just try to push in on our opponent. Here's Hookhand Clyde for the wing bang bang. Thank you, ma'am, but he goes down. Ike putting in the DPS, and it's going to be that candy bar. Oh, Terrence. Oh, Terrence. Terrence, you shouldn't have. You should have. And he shall. He took that second candy bar with no problemo. Barely an inconvenience. Looking to get this hook hand Clyde all up in it. All up in it, baby. Three, two, one. Let's go. And that's going to be G. G. Moon, give me power. Good game. Good game. But so close, let's continue on. Let's chitty chat more. Action! Clyde Frog says boss. Hug the boss. Chicken boss? Not quite sure what it says. Chicken boss, maybe. Jay Riz says, Hayes watches Screen Rant, lol. Yeah, dude, I love I love Screen Rant. I love it, dude. We got Master LPL Nomino P. Master LPN Elimino P. Yes, dude. <laughs> Super easy, barely an inconvenience, dude. He says that shit every time in, in his videos. It's so awesome. That's Ben Cartman, though. We're gonna super soak him with that lobster. Bring in the pain, bring in the A game. He's got the Nathan on board. And let's drop that Aerostorm. Gonna bring down the Zen Carmen as quickly as possible so we can lock and load onto his other unit. The Nathan goes down through the Aerostorm, through the fire and the flames. 
Sally gonna go down, but PC Principal locked onto that NK. Whoa, so close to locking onto that NK. There we go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. But a go. Hey, that lightning bolt gonna bring down his next up card. Potentially, no. That's gonna be GG. Oh no, Terrence and Philip gonna take that hit. They're gonna take that. Yep, there we go. <laughs> there was a little bit of delay there, as our opponent may have quit out of the game. Good game. What's up, Mecca from the 80s? Says, hi. Dion Cantero says, wow, this is epic. Well, thank you. We definitely trying to put on a good show. Clyde Frog said, cheers. Jay Ray says, I love the pitch meetings as well. Yes, the pitch meetings are fantastic. And uh, the dude that does those videos for Screen Rant has his own YouTube channel, I found out, too. But he does uh, a lot shorter videos. But they're still funny. You know what I mean? It's still his similar character style. So let's go ahead and open up that seventh PvP pack of the day. Can we get that program? Dan, one copy away from level five. We've got 311 PvP tickets. We are also 21 copies away from getting Mimsy up okay, to level seven. Bit, but I don't think we're gonna get 21 copies in one PvP pack. <laughs> as well as plenty of other legendary cards that only need one more copy to get to level three. Let's go ahead and refresh this PvP pack for the eighth one of the day. j says, oh yeah, 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 got it. Mecha says, I lost two games, but it wasn't my fault. Bad internet screwed one match for me. Dang, that sucks. Never fun. We are six out of 12 with two losses. Rolling the dice. Who's it gonna be? Brrrr. And your opponent, my opponent, who's, who's, it's not your opponent, it's my opponent, is gonna be, come on, come on, Brrrr. ching Verbal Kinta Kuntify, it's gonna be from Dire Tide as well. Yep, we've got it. Rolling. They see me hating. Trying to catch me riding dirty. Trying to catch me riding Alien Clyde. Trying to catch me riding Alien Clyde. Oh. I think we can do a stand of many moons here. I do believe. I do believe. I do, do, do believe. I do believe. Here comes that lightning bolt from our opponent. He takes down... Our assassin with his princess Kenny. And we got the Robo Baby for the defense. Gonna eat him up, eat him up, eat him up. That far only gonna do so much. Can we get the PC principal out in time? He will have that arrow storm. No doubt about it. No, it's gonna be the own PC principal art. Robo Baby locked onto NK there for a moment. Oh my, we put the we put the Ike on the wrong side. Oops. <laughs> that was a good one. Definitely put that character in the right spot. He meant to be on the bottom side of him. Oh my. Would have made all the difference. We're looking to hook hand Clyde anything and everything. It's like we have a new subscriber to the channel. Who's it gonna be? That hook hand Clyde looking to clutch it. And he hits the NK. You know it, baby. And we're going all in it. Spin it to win it. In it. To win it, that Blood Elf Baby could do too much damage here. Ooh. And here it is, that alien Clyde ready to take her out, and it's gonna be Sergio Garcia. Thank you so very much, and welcome to the channel. He brings, he busts out the the Terrence and Philip. The damage not gonna be enough from our. Ooh, here we go. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Chill out. One minute remaining. One minute remaining. He's hitting it hard. And <laughs> that's game. Good game. And that's the end of the run. We got four or five wins. Walter Glenda said, oh, really? A leaderboard? Yes, there will be a leaderboard for the event this weekend. Pilly just said, I went 12-0, only lost two bars, and only left two bars on the table. And I'm still sitting at, like, 450 in the challenge rankings. Damn. Walter Glenda said, I'm having disconnection issues today. What happens a lot before the card events. So let's go ahead and open up these six packs. 
That's a six pack, boys. You know what I'm saying? Because it means no worries. Totally just said, I'm, yep, I'm going to run a six point deck LLC. How well I can beat all the other D rankers. <laughs> well, it said, seems like very likely that I will start the event at 15k event. Okay, okay, okay. See if we can get some more priest maxis. So it seems like our adventure sci-fi deck did not work out as well as the fantasy adventure deck. Blood Elf Bebe, Princess Kenny, Paladin Butters being so much stronger than uh, using Enforcer Jimmy. Sally Jones. You know what I'm saying? All good, though. We still were able to finish once. I forgot to look and see where our rank was. Let's check out our rank here. I forgot. I said I was going to check it earlier. I said it's only a few seconds away. I should remember. But I did not remember. I like rares, don't you? Whoa, nice rare. All right. Rare, that's it. Just a rare. You stack new kids. Let's see where we placed on the leaderboard. Somewhere in, after 251 and 800. We got 432. I'm okay with that. That gets us the 700 PvP tickets. I'm cool with that. I like PvP tickets. I like it a lot. That's going to be the end of our challenge run, but we still have four out of five for this PvP pack, so let's go ahead and do some of that ranked matchmaking. Pillage 30 said AF still king of challenge mode. <coughs> Pillager 30 said, nice haze better than me. Oh, really? Mm. Okay, 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 okay. Not too bad then, I guess. Not too bad. <laughs> Let's see if we can get four candy bars in this one game. Just kidding. <laughs> now, at least guarantee we got two more matches, but I got a special deck for you guys if you did not see it. It's going to be that Mimsy Crush Mystical Sci-Fi coming at you. That no one understands. Mom and Dad always giving him command. We got two to little from Elite Revolt. Can we bring the Mimsy A game? Cause then re This will be the last time today will be the last time we ever see a level six Mimsy on this stream. So read them and weep, boys. Read them and weep. We gonna go in it with that program stand and sexy nun Randy. We have got a bounty hunter cow, but so do we, and we've got ours targeted onto his. The amazingly, Randy not going to be able to manage or to put the damage out in time to take down our bounty hunter cow. We've got the program stand locked onto the NK. It's going to be a hallelujah across the board, and our bounty hunter cow is going to be able to survive the blast and continue on. How though, uh, this amazingly, Randy is strong. Strong King Kong. Let's go ahead and bust out another sexy quiet I mean, uh, sexy nun Randy's quiet boy. Quiet boy. Check out this trip. I feel like we can put a tally in here. He can figure this out a lot easier than anybody else could. Oh no, it's too many chickens. It's too late to apologize. It's too late to apologize. Can we get that Mimsy crush? Can we get him in there? We have to protect the Bebe here. She may go down because there's too many units and not enough damage output. Oh man. Oh, blood out. Rubble Bebe not putting in the damage. I thought she had it there. But we can't get the Mimsy out there. We can't get the Rubble Bebe boosted up. That's what I was hoping to do anyway, here. Chocolate shake. Alright, he's gonna waste our freeze. Excelente. 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 Guess we just go ahead and get rid of that right there. I'm 
gonna beat you like it's Sunday school. We got this. We got this under control. Our cow is gonna take care of that cow. Our sexy nun Randy's gonna take care of the shield maiden and Wendy. And we're ready to bust out the Mimsy. Come on, Mimsy. You can do this. You got this. You got this, Mimsy. It's all in the hips. It's all in the hips. It's all in the hips. It's all in the hips, baby. Hallelujah. Oh, the wrong ho wrong hallelujah. That was definitely not the right hallelujah. Maybe. Maybe. Actually, come on, come on, come on. Yes. 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 Oh, he's alive. He's alive. But there's too many chickens. There's too many chickens on the field. Can Robo Bebe in the chicken? Oh my, there's too many chickens. There's way too many chickens. And the Marcus put in the ability to, de to destroy up here. Can Robo Bebe get boosted up here? That's what we need right now. That's GG. Good game, good game. Too many chickens, too little time. Too many chickens, too little time. Taco Tucker said, I can feel that program stand just waiting for you in this PvP pack. Pillar just said, LOL, solid Happy Gilmore reference. I probably did quote Happy Gilmore, but I can't remember what I said right now. <laughs> kind of wish I could remember. I'm, I wouldn't doubt it at all that I would quote Happy Gilmore. It's an awesome movie. MZ just not able to put in the damage there. But, we did get one candy bar. We did get one. Come on, let's get the Mimsy Joker going. Oh yeah, Pillage of 30, that's right. It's all in the hips. It's all in the hips. We shouldn't have hallelujah there. We lost the game because of the hallelujah. We got Pippi Pip from Canada number one. I was hoping to keep my Bounty Hunter Kyle and uh, the other unit alive, but we ended up just uh, healing Bounty Hunter Kyle. Wait, yeah. Um, I can't remember, but I just know that the Hallelujah wasn't exactly the best Hallelujah. It's the sixth element Randy level three. That means that Mecha Timmy is anywhere in there. Most definitely, no doubt about it. BHK gonna start boosting up that attack damage across the board. Dog Poo gonna do his best job to hold the front line while we build up ours. Our back line. Our super notoriously powerful. Sexy Nun Randy gonna Kamehameha blast him in the face with some karate chops. That level 6. That level 6 Enforcer Jimmy and level 6 Mephisto. They're gonna get boosted up with the BHK. But that slow motion hopefully can hit them in time. To give us time to rewind. I don't think we can stop him in time. She doesn't have the damage output. And they're already getting ridiculous. And she goes down with the bar. Even better for our opponent. Program initiated. Take flight. Oh, that hook hand caught going down. We're just going to have to poke Timmy this. Poke Timmy for the twins. Here comes the fireball for the cleanup, and that's going to be game. Good game. Yep. Uh, he is, he's ranked 80, so he's definitely in the top 100. Till it's 30. Alrighty, come on, we're gonna finish up this 8th PvP pack and we're gonna be getting up out of here.
gonna be all Mercs are Virgins from South Pirates. What a hilarious name. Gonna be the Mecha Timmy coming out from our opponent. We just need to get him to get my control on our dog poo. I'm going to stop you in the mud. We'll freeze our tally, letting him not do any damage to us. There's a rogue token, but we've got the hallelujah, which is not going to be enough damage or heal, I don't think, to really make a difference here as well. Maybe not. I don't know. Next Timmy definitely going to finish up this fight, though. I don't think we can get unholy combustion on him in time, really. Our Kyle's going to get killed by being mind-controlled here. No, maybe not. But he's definitely getting that candy bar. Blood Elf Baby gonna take down our bounty hunter Kyle with no problemo. I'm gonna beat you like it's Sunday school. And we've got the sexy nun Randy out there trying to put out some work, but our opponent is just gonna completely overwhelm us. Savagely. Wesley Lopes said, finish the challenge. Yes, we did. We finished the first run 12 and 2. The second run, we finished 6 and 3. Let's just go ahead and throw the Mimsy in and end the game because I don't think we can win it. Pretty sure we can't win it. I don't think so. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. What up, baby? Gonna take down our Robo Baby? No problemo. We're not gonna be able to defend from the Wombo Cambo there. Pretty much being able to do absolutely nothing right now. No doubt about it. Oh, they Sarah goes says, "What rank is this guy?" I I don't know. Check out. So the thirty said, "Out, rip." Yes, could we this. hurry up and finish the match? Thank you very much. We're trying to get this eight PVP pack and get on up out of here. Trying to play this Mimsy, but we having a tough time. Having a tough time indeed. Him just not putting in the work. Can we get a match that we can get some Mimsy crush? That's what I'm looking for. Andrew Isbell says, damn push crushed. It's gonna be that Arlarly from Dire Tide. Your new best friend. The Osimo coming out from our opponent, and I just feel silly every time because it's pretty much like fighting like Zen Cartman. We'll just go ahead and unholy combust him for the surprise dog poo to the face. There's dog poo on dog poo. We do not have unholy combustion ready because we just already used it. Bless you, Charles. Mind Control from Mecha Timmy coming out very shortly here. Mind Control on our sexy nun Randy only gonna be good for us and not for him. Not for him indeed. Oh, he was able to kill it. Ooh, he was able to kill our sexy nun Randy. Can we get the Pope Timmy out there? Thank you for mind controlling that. And have a nice day. 
Come on, sexy nut Randy, can you put in the work versus these level three legendary cards? That's gonna be a no. He goes down very quickly. Let's get the tally out there. Our Pope Timmy getting the boost of damage, but Mecha Timmy gonna be able to get his ability off here very soon and kill our Pope Timmy with our own tally. No, he survives. He survives, and it's gonna be the Mecha Timmy. The Mecha Tim, I mean the Mimsy crush. Our Pope Timmy locked onto Mecha Timmy. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Oh wait, he get knocked back too far away. That suck my. There we go. There's our Pope Timmy. He goes down. All right, Pope or Mecha Timmy, get on up out of here. We ain't got time for you. We take the candy bar. 54 seconds remaining. Our opponent ready to punish us for our push. The freeze from our opponent not going to be in time, although there is a DKC on the field. We have to negate this Shield Maiden's ability. He's going to get the candy bar. He is definitely going to get the candy bar. We have no way to stop this. And that Marcus is going to survive to throw the pillow into the next... Uh, the, um, <laughs> the next candy bar. Come on, blow him down, Tally. You got this. I think he may have overpushed potentially. I'm gonna beat you like it's Should give us a good chance here. That I really do I think he overpushed. The Mecha Timmy coming out at six element Randy, but I think we can get we get a Hallelujah in here. A hallelujah missing our tally, but our sexy nun Randy and our Kyle going to survive. Our tally putting in the work, and that's going to be GG. We get them two candy bars. Good game. Bishop Graham says, LOL, you two seem to have a lot in common. Bishop says, is Professor Chaos and F. Meister the same person? No. They are definitely two different people. <laughs> definitely two different people. That's pretty funny, though. Professor, that's because we have almost the same amount of subs. Yeah, they do have really close to the same amount of subs, too. That is funny. Andrew Isbell says, game and match. That's right. That's right. We finally were able to pull that Mimsy crush out. Bringing that pain. That A-game. But that still leaves us with one more candy bar to go. Let's get this level six Mimsy on his final round of matches before he is retired and then promoted into that level seven Mimsy crush. Gonna be right at the beginning of tomorrow's stream. It should be about, well, it should be at 2 p.m. because I'm going to wait until after the developer stream. They'll have their stream starting my time, my time, 12 to 15 p.m. That is when they start their stream. And then uh, usually they'll have it done by 2. So I can have my stream wait until then. We've got Lucio Tanini from Mercenaries. Fellow Merc. Taco Taco says, I sub chaos. There we go. That's what's up. Doodly doodly doo. Doodly 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 doo. Come on, program stand. Get it together. Get it together, mate. Do 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 do. Ooh. 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 Was that worth it? Was it worth it? Did we do something too crazy there? Medusa Bebe could definitely put in some punishment for that move. Robo Bebe, though. Robo Bebe, ladies and gentlemen. Robo Baby. All right, all right, all right. If that hook hand Clyde hits our Robo Baby, we're in a lot of trouble. Yep. He's gonna get that candy bar, no doubt about it. Oh, right as we're trying to smack the Medusa Baby, she flies past us, and now we have no way to target her down. Oh. 
All we can do is try to push onto this, this Santa Mini Moon here. Oh, come on. Hermes Kenny, really? Hermes Kenny putting in some work there. Now we have nothing for the Medusa Bebe. We slow down Dog Poo. That's going to be a lot of the damage difference here. Can we get the snake first? We need the freeze. He gets the the lightning bolt onto our Robo Bebe, making sure we have no way to make a big comeback there. The Choir Boy putting in the hit. Oh my, we got 55 seconds remaining. He gets the sexy nun Randy out there. Is Tally going to be enough to do the damage here? That's going to be a no. And he's got the hook hand Clyde. He's way ahead of us on energy right now. He takes the candy bar. So we don't even have a chance now. I do believe we don't have a chance now. So let's go ahead and put energy out there. Yep. GG. Good game. We got the final candy bar, and that's going to be the end of the stream. Thank you all so very much for hanging out during the live stream. And I hope you guys appreciate the content. And if you did, like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. We're going to go ahead and open up that eighth PvP pack of the day. I just wanted to say that because some people do leave before the end of the stream. But we are opening up that 8th PvP pack, and then I'm going to do a shout-out for everybody who commented in the chat today. I just seen Asmita Bandita joined. What do you know about that? <laughs> 290 PvP tickets, 3 cash monies. Keep going, new kids. And that's going to be it on the PvP pack. Let's start doing those shoutouts. It's going to be Yoshi Lover, Professor Chaos, Wesley Lobes, Roger Deka, Chucky Cheese, Bird, Demonco LP, Captain Diabetes. F Meister, A Biogenesis Gaming, J Rage, Alois, Mr. Miller, Walter Galindo, J Rage, Mr. Ninth Army, Blades, Fabian Taylor, Taco Taco, Sneakies YT, Bishop Graham, Giovanni Vanilla. Woodland Critters, Sean O, Mosquito, Clyde Donovan, Nasty Chicken Foot donated today. Thank you so very much for supporting the stream. Really appreciate it, man. Feeling the love today. Bishop Graham, Jose Zaragoza, Yum Yum, Victor Diaz. Caden Waddington, Slavius, Nyanjenski, Hypnotic Ranger, Dano732, Stan Marsh, Caesar Marin, Flamberg the General Fire, Fabuki, Alexander Doolit. Alter Pena, Hola Amigo Itas, Peter Parker, Victor Diaz, Roy VIP, Keandro Van West, Alta Pena, Kalu Frolic, Cat Dog, Bow Dow, Cat Dog, Mago Julio 666, Gabriella 123321, Calajon de Alex 1 times 9, Lizard666 Clyde Frog Gusties 
Diane Cantero. Mecca from the 80s. Andrew Isbell. Asmita Bandita. And that's going to be it, guys. Thank you all so very much, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Good luck on the challenge if you're still trying to get in it to win it. And tomorrow's event's going to be that Mr. Hanky, so stay tuned. That level 7 Mimsy coming at you tomorrow. And possibly a level 5 program stand. And possibly a level 3 legendary. I don't know which one. It could be glorious, though. It could be definitely a wonderful day, that's for sure. Peace out, everybody. Peace.